isn't Elon Musk actually suing Disney and a bunch of other big corporations for smearing him for saying he's racist because he's allowing pro-Israeli people on on Twitter or X, I guess. What I heard what happened was he agreed and said that's total truth to something that was full. Well, some people have claimed to be anti-Semitic. So then he set up a meeting with the prime minister, Netanyahu of Israel, and he went over there and they gave him this, you know, first class service to show him this is the truth. Now you can see the truth firsthand. And so then after that, yesterday, he had an interview, I think, with CBC, CNBC on this public platform. And that guy who was interviewing Elon, and I think this was literally yesterday, asked him. But there's a public perception that that was part of a apology tour, if you will. That were, this had been said online. There was all of the criticism. There was advertisers leaving. We talked to Bob Iger today. I hope today. they stop. You hope? Uh, don't advertise. You don't want them to advertise? No. What do you mean? If, if somebody's going to try to blackmail me with advertising, blackmail me with money, go f*** yourself. But go f*** yourself. <laughs> is that clear? I, I hope it is. Hey, Bob, if you're in the audience. Well, that's not the thing I was talking about, but yeah. Because, uh, if yeah. Yeah, I heard about that too, but this was a different thing. He, that, the interviewer was probably talking about that thing, maybe. I don't know. I'd have to do more research. Yeah, whatever that anti-Semite remark was, that's the whole reason this whole thing got started. Yeah, he's actually suing like four or five big major companies who casting shade on X, saying X is this uh, racist platform now. And if you have these big businesses propagating this stuff, then yeah, you have to sue them to get that, that soap out of their mouth.